In the e-block today, some very scary moments for Miley Cyrus and her crew when her plane made an emergency landing after it was hit by a bolt of lightning Tuesday night while flying to Paraguay. The singer posted a video on Instagram showing lightning outside of the plane and a photo of apparent damage to the plane's exterior. She wrote, quote, our plane was caught in a major unexpected storm and struck by lightning. My crew, band, friends and family who were all traveling with me are safe after an emergency landing. Cyrus was on her way to headline a music Music festival on Wednesday, but was unable to fly because of that inclement weather. Get ready to be Rick Rolled all over again. Rick Astley is re releasing the album that made him a star. It's been 35 years since his debut album, Whenever You Need Somebody, and that classic hit, Never Gonna Give You Up. Well, now BMG is marking the anniversary in May with a two CD set and a digital release that will have remastered original album, plus B sides, remixes, and Astley's own reimagined versions of the album's original singles. Never Gonna Give You Up spent two weeks at number one on the U.S. Billboard Hot 100 and Together Forever spent a week atop the same chart. Astley is also joining new kids on the block, Salt and Peppa, and En Vogue for the 57 date mixtape 2022 U.S. Arena Tour, which will make a stop at Van Andel Arena in June. Now to the 94th Academy Awards this Sunday night. Getting a nomination for an Academy Award is a big deal, but sharing the recognition with your spouse in the same year deserves twice the celebration. ABC's Morgan Norwood shows us the couples who are joining Hollywood's short list of partners with this rare feat. An Oscar nomination is always exciting, and when there's two, it's double the accomplishment. At the 2022 Academy Awards, two couples are nominated at the same time. On the ballot in their respective lead acting categories, Penelope Cruz and Javier Bardem, the two married since 2010. I was changed to this country, Lucy. Javier Bardem for his role in being the Ricardos and Cruz in the running for best actress in a leading role for Parallel Mothers. They're the sixth married couple to ever be nominated together in the same year. Really special for me. And on top of that, being nominated the same year as my husband. There's also Kirsten Dunst and Jesse Plemons. They're both nominated for their supporting performances in The Power of the Dog. The couple has been together since 2016, so their chemistry on screen, 100% authentic. In terms of all the like underneath things and the feelings for each other, we didn't have to create. So that, that, that's there already. So with that chemistry, is there any competition? Dunst, who is a voting member of the Academy, says she has her preferred picks. Obviously, I will vote for Jess. I'll vote for everyone in our movie, for sure. <laughs> Hollywood has a storied history of married couples being nominated and winning Academy Awards dating back to 1931. The last time was in 1966 with Richard Burton and Elizabeth Taylor, who were both nominated for Who's Afraid of Virginia Woolf, uh, came from the same movie. And we can't forget Brangelina, Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie in 2009, and the late Heath Ledger and Michelle Williams in 2006. This is not very often, but, you know, it shows where greatness and talent tend to fall in love. Morgan Norwood, ABC News, Los Angeles. Do you have any plans to see Rick Astley when he comes to town? Never gonna get <laughs> you. <laughs> we know someone who's going, actually. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we I do. was hoping you were gonna break out your day. We had a dance party we this did, afternoon. Actually, yeah. You missed it, this one. Smoke in the rug. Yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> hey.